Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Audio Visual and Lighting Engineers. In this video, we are going to configure Barco Clickshare CX series. Let's start. Connect the power and internet LAN cable to your device and turn on the Barco Clickshare. After that, you will get this screen. Search the Clickshare Wi-Fi and it will show name of clickshare and the number then connect and put the password clickshare then press next once the wi-fi connect open your internet browser and the default ip will be 192.168.2.1 and enter then i understand the risk the password will be admin then login this is a configuration setup now started then press the next button now it's showing for the firmware update if you have firmware you can manually update from here otherwise press the next button then next page is personalization then you can rename the room name you can put whatever your meeting room name you can add from here next option is location you can put your location next page is system page from there you can select the time zone date and time next page is security page press the next button then next page is for the password page you can create the new password here then press the next button and the new page will be open that is network page you can change your wi-fi ssid name uh, like before it's showing clicks here so if you want to change that one you can change from here and if you want to change the password and you can change the password from here next page is smart care for the clicks here here showing for the how to register for the xms cloud so you can press the next and configuration is all is successfully finished now press the finish configuration once the finish the device will reboot it will take few seconds after the rebooting you can find your new ssid in the your wi-fi setting then connect with the new password once the device is connected with the wi-fi you can do your click share advanced configuration first option is personalization on screen id wallpaper and configuration page you can find here next option is display option display and audio and peripherals you can find here next option is wi-fi and network you can change your wi-fi setting lan setting and services all setting you can add it from here next option is security level you can see your all security level here then password if you want change your password next option is system you can find your base unit status date and time energy saver your barco click share button 
your blackboard and next final is xms cloud i will show you how the code will generate here so let's see next option is support and troubleshoot from where update you can do manually here and next option is troubleshoot if you want reset your device or want any support you can get from the troubleshoot option now this is important your device should be connected on the internet once your device connected with the internet it will show the device token number so this is you have to copy and add in the xms cloud in the next video i will show you how to cre create and add to xms cloud thank you for the watching video